1619 is when I was first dehumanized. When a crowd of eagerly bleached eyes scoped 20 dark and hued guys, I was there. I was them. I essentially property print property. I was probably pro thoroughly. My muscles checked perfectly, quite possibly mentally, the first time I was told, jump, nigger, jump. Fast forward. A few hundred years, find me where I stand on the edge of the ledge of this thing they call life, pelted by sticks and stones, sticks and stones. And as I look over the edge, reality strikes and I realize the water below me is warm. She's black, for the record, the word nigger has always hurt me. It hurt me back when I was a slave. Carrying white pain America on my back. I, in pain, became the master's peace. No peace in my pace. Forced to sack up, carry heavy burden, white cotton wide, skin full of waste. My skin was my sin. Entertain the white men, I was told. Contain the black sin. I was bold enough back then to pray to their God. To be fair, their God's fair. His skin silk white fine divine i was merely desperate to find freedom and harry it up because harriet tubman had left me behind white demands apprehended my throat nigga get your behind over here nigga come here and entertain me jump for me nigga those white whip scars still paint my back they painted it through the proclamations even through the emancipation, we chanted praise and pain. My black voices continue to pray again and again. We shall, we came, we came, we came, oh Lord. I came and was murdered by this life because the white man was able. He was biblically able for I was the cursed ham. Scientifically able for I was the filthy monkey. Legally able for I was reconstructed by Plessy. Supreme racism. Father by old Jim Crow. I was... Left behind, Bible, right in hand, I was left for dead, I was legally enslaved, scientifically ordained, biblically prayed, I was lynched by my faith, noosed by my hope, while old Jim Crow, he held all the ropes, keeping me in fear, puppeteer controlling me like a puppet, yelling, make me some dinner, nigga. Tonight I want some ham. But before entertaining you, filthy monkey, I am your supreme, so entertain me, nigga, and jump, but... You found me where I stand, on the edge of the ledge of strife, chained up like an animal in the land of the free, home of the slave, dehumanized by white lies, man, power devised, the man's power neutralized, their disguised pigs released their howls. And I was told not to make a sound to pacify, hoping that the dogs ripping the flesh off my bones would just simply pass by. I resisted in tears, for I believed in Dr. King's dream. I believed even when I watched that gunshot put Dr. King into deep sleep, I heeded the words of Malcolm X. Even as I watched him take 15 to the chest and him put to rest, fast forward, those voices that had commanded me, that had demanded me to hold my head up with a passionate pride, had all died off. Inside, I found myself, I found myself being told by my own kind through words laced with heavy bass and dope beats to jump, 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 nigga, jump, jump. What? That's on the radio. Brainwashed. I can only focus on the fresh J's on my feet while my soul steadily unclean, head down in defeat, asking what's up. Fast forward. I passed the ball in my hands, white coach yelling at us niggas to jump fast forward. Past the days of the blunts, bad bitches, and boastful vulgar when I was yelling, it's my jump, my nigga. Fast forward, past persistent postmodern racist persecution from all sides, past our own acceptance and praise of this ignorant past, our welfare-based impoverished state, past the sermons of Waka Flocka, Two Janes, and Juicy J, fast forward, Past the educational inequality, past the lack of resources to move up effectively society, past the crack, the stats, the facts, blacks more likely to commit homicide and be 
shot by the police at the same time past Rodney King, Sean Bell, Trey Bond, Skills, and all the other incidences past whatever the media's publishing past Barack Obama struggles against hard-headed Republicans. Fast forward, past it all, past it all to where I stand, where I stand, push to the edge of this thing called life because this is where you wanted me, right? I guess those hundreds of years of being reminded that I can never quite be white, but only a nigger who can jump had finally paid off. Here I stand. Push to the ledge, push to the edge, looking calmly upon the warm black water, thinking. Thinking that I've been trained to do one thing my whole entire life, and that's to be a nigger ready to jump. Warm, salt water fills my human eyes. Here I am, exhausted. Exhausted from being pelted by 400 years of sticks and stones. Sticks and stones, and out of everyone and everything that I have ever encountered in my lifetime. She, the warm black water below, is most familiar. She has never heard me.